Hey everybody, we're back in Central Florida this weekend. Yeah, back in February, we stopped at a place north of Orlando that we just had a blast at. It's, it's called the Yalaha Bootlegging Company, and then we'll put their link below. It is a Harvest Host location. We discovered it in February and absolutely love it. Come along with us on this video to check it out. Uh, if you're in Central Florida, it is a must stop. You've got to uh, hang out and visit. But wait, what is so exciting about this place? Oh yeah, boondocking, blueberries, and bootlegging. You cannot go wrong with those three things. Yep, yep. come along with us. All right. Well Order blueberry pie. I did order blueberry pie, the last one. The last one. They're holding it back for us. Why can't we eat it now? I'm not ready for it right now. Are you ready for it? I'm ready for it. February and visited with you and had an awesome time. We had to come back and uh, see you in the spring right at the peak of blueberry season. So uh, tell us a little bit about your place and what's happening today at, at uh, the Bootleggers. Well, the Yulaha Bootlegging Company, we've got a uh, you pick season's in full swing right now. We've got a lot of people coming out from Orlando, a lot of people just discovering us. We're distilling and of course we have entertainment, barbecue, pies, shakes, floats. I could go on for a while, but it's wasted time. But the blueberries are the main thing right now. We trim them back, trim a third of the bush off, then we fertilize them, and we keep them going all the way through the summer. Okay. Then we everything starts off in January and December. They bloom again, and it's three months from bloom to berry. So we're in that peak time you right now. You were in the official blueberry season, the peak of blueberry season. Okay. Yeah. Pick a blue and fry it. What makes one different from the other? Just the variety. Yeah. Size or? Let's see. T size and the taste and the amount on the bush and the yield. Mm. Wow. What do you think? It's awesome. <laughs> it's fun to watch the kids out here. We're all organic, you know. Yeah. It's just, they're, they're running around, they're picking, they're eating, they're not worried about washing it because they know who picked yep. it. And it's just, it's fun. It's a little, little bit, I think kids are such sort of strollers and now they're, yeah. you know, 10 Coming years old it. out here. Yeah, that's awesome. It's kind of passing the torch to the next generation of you pickers. Yeah. And let's be honest, you can't pick a lot of stuff. I mean, kids forget how to, where food comes from. It doesn't come from Publix. Oh, yeah. It does, but you know, this is where it comes from the plant. They come out and they do this and yeah, they're they're like, they oh, appreciate yeah. it more. Oh yeah, they do, they do. <laughs> But the distilling is what I picked up on. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. We are running, uh, we're getting ready for Bike Fest. We got picked up by the Leesburg Partnership for Leesburg Bike Fest. So we're having to do a lot of distilling between now and April 25th, trust yeah, us. Yeah, right, right. I bought a bottle of the pecan maple last night, right? Is that what yeah, it's called? Yeah, it's just pecan. But pecan. Oh man. But we mix it with Moonshine, this moonshine is unbelievable. We, that's one reason why we had to come back. But you know, he's a harvest host location, awesome place. We stayed last night and um, pitch black dark, we're, uh, secluded, quiet. Um, 
it was perfect place. But then you come out today, it's a happening vibe. He's got music, he's got uh, moonshine, he's got the blueberries, a organic blueberry field. We we just picked one right off the vine and ate it. It's it's awesome. So, how long have you been on this property? Uh, since uh, we started the farm in 2007, I've been here 14 years. Uh, right. 13 years. I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, we, we like seeking out places that are organic and uh, we can drink at the same time. So that's pretty cool. There you go. <laughs> Thank you for coming out and staying with us. Yeah, no, we uh, this will be one of our regular stops, wouldn't you say, Gina? Thank Absolutely. You. Yeah. Thanks, buddy. Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it. Glad to be uh -huh. here. Thanks, Doug.